Hello students, in this video we'll discuss what should be the study plan for the upcoming NEET PG 2024 which is scheduled to happen next year. The dates haven't been announced for the NEET PG 2024 and also we'll discuss simultaneously the study plan for INICT 2023 which is scheduled to happen in November uh, this year. Now today is September 4th and uh, the INICT this year will be on 5th November. The dates for the same have has been announced so you have around two months left for the INICT preparation and for NEET PG the exam in my opinion will likely to happen in around March or let's say early April so you have around good seven months uh, for preparation or NEET PG. Now before I start this video and tell you the study strategy what uh, for whom is this video made for now this particular video in my opinion is made for those who haven't yet started their preparation seriously thoroughly who like are maybe not serious about the preparation thinking that okay this time i won't get selected i'll start preparing for next year and i'll really like to tell you that this is the time when you should start studying and it's a very very achievable task especially the neat pg even if you start now like even if you start in september there is a good chance that you can get a good rank in neat pg 2024 with respect to inict i think Two months uh, is a little short time if you're just starting now, but still INICT is a very good interim target for the NEET which is 2024. Now this video is not intended for someone who is already on track of his PG preparation, who has a study schedule with him or her and who is studying continuously, let's say uh, from third and fourth prof onwards for, till internship and now if post internship do whatever you are doing if you are uh, that student switch off this video this video is mainly for someone who is starting his preparation and is confused about it now first point before you know how to do it is to know what you are preparing for so for first uh, point i would like to say that know your exam so as you all know the inict is uh, heavily biased towards first and second prof so you will have around 60 percent questions that will come uh, from first and second prof and the remaining 40% questions from the third and fourth prof. Uh, and in contrast to this, NEET PG is more focused towards third and fourth prof. So I'd say around 50-50% uh, between first, second prof and third, fourth prof. But this can vary again 40-60 uh, or so. So if you know what you're preparing for, you'll study similar subjects accordingly. right? So keeping this in mind, what should be your timeline if you're targeting NEET PG? 2024. So I'd say target the INICT like keep 5th November as a realistic timeline that till 5th November at least I'll complete my first second prof subjects forensic medicine and toxicology and a very important subjects OBS and gynae. So I'll tell you these only these subjects you try to complete till 5th November that is INICT. Now in November and December Try to complete the remaining major subjects that is pediatric surgery medicine uh, and community medicine plus minor clinical subjects like peds, derma, of the ENT, uh, psychiatry, etc. Now, in from January till mid Feb, so you'll have around one and a half months for that. That is where you do your first revision, and from mid Feb to early March, you do your second revision, and then the last ten days before the exam. So I'm assuming the exam might happen towards March end. So you'll have around 10 days left before you give the final exam. And in that last 10 days, believe me, it is a very important time for you to revise the entire syllabus, okay? to revise all the 19 subjects. What students usually do is that, uh, like especially those who have uh, recently started studying and have not been studying for quite some time. So if you are someone who's starting now, like last 10 day revision will boost your rank like anything because it will keep every think fresh in your memory so keep the last 10 day revision strategy in mind and start preparing it now only so where to study from so i've told you that till 5th november this year that's 2023 try to complete first second year obs and gynae and forensic medicine right but where to study these from panna kahan se hai ye? so a lot of students jo ki wo galti karte hain ki they if time par they start seeing the main videos कि ओके okay, हमें अच्छे से वीडियोस देखने हैं हमने पूरे वीडियोस नहीं देखे पता नहीं उसमें कौन सी ऐसी नई नॉलेज हमें मिल जाएगी सो इफ यू आर वाचिंग वीडियोस राइट नाउ यू आर वेस्टिंग योर टाइम ओके राइट नाउ इट्स नॉट द टाइम टू वॉच मेन वीडियोस उसका टाइम चला गया थर्ड फोर्थ प्रॉफ था मे बी इंटर्नशिप था अभी फ्यू आर स्टार्टिंग प्रिपरेशन एंड टारगेटिंग द नीट पीज टू अभी मेन वीडियोज मत देखो एज ए प्राइमरी सोर्स इफ यू वॉन्ट टू रीड 
read main notes okay reading main notes is quicker than you know watching a video on 2x or 1.5x but main notes kiske uthane hain like sare subjects ke uthane hain kis subjects ke you should start reading main notes so whatever subjects you are weak in okay for uh, let's say you are uh, weak in pediatrics so you you go ahead and uh, pick up main notes for pediatrics but 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 whenever you are reading main notes of any subject okay at that point in time you have to make it a point that you are concising them simultaneously okay concising them is very important during your first reading itself right so your first reading should be your reading plus concising okay so your first reading itself should focus on concising and first reading in my opinion is not the reading where you memorize stuff okay a lot of students think ki okay this in first reading i'll try to memorize everything first that is not going to happen because memorizing is a complex uh, procedure which takes into account you know reading revising registering recalling and so in first reading you should just focus on ki okay this is important this is not important this is important this is not important important thing i am either circling it tearing off the pages and uh, putting it in my own copy or you know marking them folding pages or reading simultaneously revision notes along with the main notes so how do you concise your main notes during your first reading so a you directly uh, note the extra points uh, so main notes go through quickly i would say and add the extra stuff that you read directly into the revision notes so dono ko saath saath khol lo main notes yahan par hai revision notes yahan par hai let's say maine ek congenital heart disease पढ़ा फ्रॉम पीडियाट्रिक्स फ्रॉम द मेन नोट और यहाँ पर उसके रिविजन नोट्स हैं जो कि छोटे से दो पेज के ऐसे हैं तो मैंने जल्दी जल्दी से वो पढ़ा और फिर जल्दी जल्दी से आई गो थ्रू द रिविजन नोट एंड जो चीजें मुझे एक्स्ट्रा मिली मेन नोट्स में मैंने उसको ऊपर ऊपर रिविजन नोट्स में ही लिख लिया सो यू रिविजन नोट कीप गेटिंग मेड एज यू गो अलॉन्ग योर फर्स्ट रीडिंग इट सेल्फ एंड दिस इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट बिकॉज ये जो रिविजन नोट अब बन गए हैं ये ही मुझे बार 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 रिवाइज करने हैं अपनी सब्सिक्वेंट रिवीजन में जो कि मैंने आपको बताया कि जनवरी मिड फेब मिड फेब मार्च और लास्ट टेन डे में करना है राइट सो मेन नोट्स उनके पढ़ो जो आपके वीक सब्जेक्ट्स हैं या जो मेजर सब्जेक्ट्स हैं जिनमें से ज्यादा क्वेश्चंस आने की संभावना है ज्यादा क्वेश्चंस आने की पॉसिबिलिटी है यू कैन डायरेक्टली जम्प ऑन टू द रिविजन नोट और द रिविजन वीडियो फॉर सब्जेक्ट यू आर स्ट्रॉन्ग इन सो फॉर एग्जाम्पल आई वो स्ट्रॉन्ग इन एनाटमी सो मैंने मेन नोट Uh, जो कि हमारे टाइम पे तो रिव्यू बुक्स आती थी मैंने रिव्यू बुक्स कभी नहीं पढ़ी नाइट में की बिकॉज आई न्यू कि गोइंग थ्रू दिस विल टेक अ लॉट ऑफ टाइम बी आई ऑलरेडी न्यू अनाटमी वेल एंड रिविजन नोट्स विल जस्ट हेल्प मी रिकॉल द इम्पॉर्टेंट इम्पॉर्टेंट पॉइंट्स ऑफ अनाटमी सो मेक योर स्ट्रॉन्ग सब्जेक्ट्स लेवरेज उनको अपना स्ट्रॉन्ग पॉइंट बनाओ एंड गो थ्रू द रिविजन नोट फ्रॉम देम देर इट This strategy you can also follow that, that is directly going to the revision notes for minor subjects also because a uh, minor subjects means you need to know the breadth of the matter for all the subjects and uh, main videos kis cheez ke dekhne hai only for those jin mein aapko concepts ki kami lag rahi hai jin mein lag raha hai aapko ki okay let's say abg mera thoda weak hai mujhe se concepts nahi samajh aa rahe let's say ecg mera thoda weak hai to wo bas maine main notes se dekh liye samajhne ke liye उसको अगेन कंसाइज और रिवाइज कहां से करूंगा मैं रिविजन नोट ठीक है नाउ एक तो आई टोल्ड यू वेर यू कैन कंसाइज फर्स्ट आई टोल्ड यू रिविजन नोट यू कैन कंसाइज योर मटीरियल इन रिविजन नोट और यू कैन ऑल्सो यू साइमिलटेनियसली फर्स्ट एड नाउ फर्स्ट एड इज समथिंग दैट आई पर्सनली लाइक बिकॉज दैट इज समथिंग आई यूज ड्यूरिंग माई प्रिपरेशन एंड फर्स्ट एड इज वेरी गुड रिसोर्स फॉर स्पेशली आई वुड से फार्मा बायोकेम माइक्रो साइकी बायोस्टैट्स एंड पैथ ओके स्पेशली फॉर दीज सब्जेक्ट इट्स अ वेरी गुड रिसोर्स इफ यू वॉन्ट टू कंसाइज योर मेन नोट इन टू इट ओके एंड फाइनली फाइनली इफ यू डोंट वॉन्ट रिविजन नोट लग रहे हैं कि ओके इसमें सब कुछ कवर नहीं हो रहा फर्स्ट एड में लग रहा है कि डायरेक्टली समझ नहीं आ रहा है थोड़ा मुश्किल है समझना एंड इफ यू हैव योर ओन क्लास नोट लेट से आपने कोई भी कोचिंग लगाई ऑफलाइन कोचिंग लगाई आपकी उसके क्लास नोट बने हुए हैं तो दैट इज अगेन अ वेरी वेरी गुड रिसोर्स टू concise everything so for example alan next keep uh, taking 3 uh, to 5 days uh, classes for micro medicine surgery jisme they tell you teach you uh, entire subject in the 5 days even those class notes are very good resource for uh, you know revision note as a revision note or as a concise material to study uh, at the end so 
a big blunder right now would be to start uh, watching main videos thinking that okay i'll understand each and everything now and start preparing for my pg entrance you'll get lost okay you'll get lost in the sea of information that is there in those videos and uh, the problem with videos is that it does not help you register okay when you are reading notes there is an active registration that goes into your mind with videos it's more of a passive learning now till 5th november what i said you complete biochem pharma path micro anatomy physio obs and gynae and forensic medicine so eight subjects i am giving you in 63 days okay eight subjects i am giving you in 63 days so you can invest your time into it okay even if you um, like give six days seven days then also you'll be able to complete these eight subjects till then aur ye kahan se karna hai aapko you can study them from your main notes if you have your own offline class notes jisme sare subjects hain wahan se pad lo and at this time itself during your first reading itself concise them in first state or your revision notes don't uh, don't leave this concise thing towards the revision point of time because this concise material will become your high yield source for your further revision which you can do again and again from 5th november onwards till december complete your remaining major subjects that is surgery medicine psm pediatrics and your minors and then you know in january february you do your revisions now the question comes प्रैक्टिस कहाँ से करने क्वेश्चन की पी वाई क्यूज कहाँ से करने क्वेश्चन कहाँ से करने सो क्वेश्चन कौन से करने लास्ट फाइव ईयर्स पी वाई क्यू मिनिमम लास्ट फाइव ईयर्स पी वाई क्यूज मिनिमम प्लस क्लिनिकल ओरिएंटेड क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम योर क्वेश्चन बैंक नाउ विच एवर क्वेश्चन बैंक यू आर यूजिंग क्लिनिकल ओरिएंटेड क्वेश्चन एग्जाम्पल एल एन नेक्स्ट के मॉड्यूल में लेवल टू के नाम से आता है ये वहाँ से प्रैक्टिस कर सकते हो या इफ यूर यूजिंग एनी अदर सोर्स एवरी सोर्स एवरी एप हैज अ क्लिनिकल ओरिएटेड क्वेश्चन बैंक इन इट नाउ ग्रैंड टेस्ट कब देना है नाउ इफ यू स्टडिंग यूर स्टार्टिंग यूर प्रिपरेशन नाउ आई एम नॉट टॉकिंग अबाउट सम वन हुज बीन स्टडिंग फॉर क्वाइट सम टाइम नाउ इज ऑलरेडी ऑन अ ट्रैक फॉर हिस्स पी जी प्रिपरेशन इफ यू स्टार्टिंग यूर प्रिपरेशन नाउ आई थिंक वेरी फ्रीक्वेंट ग्रैंड टेस्ट वुड बी अ कॉन ट्राई टू गिव वन ग्रैंड टेस्ट अ मंथ एट दिस पॉइंट टू जस्ट सी योर टाइम मैनेजमेंट ओके अभी हमारा मेन पर्पज टाइम मैनेजमेंट करना है एंड लेटर यू नो वंस योर course is done like you are in december and you have completed almost quite some course then you can start giving grant test once in two weeks okay once in two weeks and last 10 days mein in my opinion koi grant test nahi dena chahiye agar aap abhi start kar rahe ho kyunki you know agar aapki usme bhi achhi rank aa gayi zaruri nahi hai ki aapki main mein aayegi aur agar usme kharab rank aa gayi aapki grant test mein to aapka moral bahut kam ho jayega for a main exam okay so just some final tips study as so this uh, this is the time where you put in your 100% you know you have to log in like 8 to 10 hours per day at this point i am not saying ki 4 ghante mein ya 5 ghante din mein padoge tabhi ho jayega abhi to padhna padega theek hai abhi to padhna padega 8 se 10 ghante din ke lagane padenge aur in 8 se 10 ghante mein 2 ghante jab aap read kar rahe ho zarur lagao ki main bhai concise karu ki next revision mein main kya padhne wala hu next revision mein main kya padhne wala hu take a break once a week at least uh, go out have some food गो वॉच अ मूवी जो भी नई आई हुई है जवान आ रही है शाहरुख खान की गो एंड वॉच इट टेक दैट ब्रेक वंस अ वीक टू यू नो रिबूट योर सेल्फ रिजुगनेट योर सेल्फ डिस्कस योर प्रिपरेशन विद वन क्लोज फ्रेंड आप ओके आपका कोई सीनियर होगा आपका कोई बहुत अच्छा जूनियर होगा आप उसके साथ रैंट कर सकते हो उसके साथ गलिया सकते हो कि ऐसा हो रहा है मेरे साथ आई एम नॉट एबल टू डू इट एक अच्छा क्लोज फ्रेंड रखो इट रियली हेल्प यू कम डाउन योर नर्व ड्यूरिंग दिस टफ टाइम and uh, don't think don't uh, assume ki i'll able to do all the 19 subjects completely during this preparation okay it is not needed okay you do not need to know everything before you appear for your pg entrance exam right nobody has done that that is not needed just try to complete important topics of all subjects that is all leverage your strong subjects for example agar aap biochemistry mein acche ho try to just finish it quickly revision notes se dekh liya previous year questions kar liye and you'll Uh, everything will come to your memory uh, fast short subjects and first second prof in my opinion are very very important because they are uh, subjects which give you a good rank in exams okay so if you want to invest time invest in first second prof subjects and minors the main strategy is concising material and revising again and again i have said this multiple times in my previous videos also 
एंड उन्होंने यही रामबाण है पी जी एंट्रेंस एग्जाम क्रैक करने का कि एक कंसाइज मटीरियल जिसको मैं बार 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 रिवाइज करूँ डोंट जस्ट रीड एक्टिवली कंसाइज ड्यूरिंग योर फर्स्ट रिविजन इट सेल्फ फर्स्ट रीडिंग इट सेल्फ दैट्स ऑल फ्रॉम माई साइड गुड लक